In general, pH balance is considered critical for maintaining optimal health. The overall chemistry in a healthy brain remains relatively neutral, so it is not unreasonable to assume that lower pH may negatively impact brain function. Previous studies have suggested that brain acidity may be a key characteristic of schizophrenia and bipolar disorder. Postmortem examinations have revealed that these patients have lower brain pH levels when compared to healthy individuals. However, this has been a controversial claim. Many researchers argue that the increased acidity is not related directly to the disorders. Rather, it is a result of confounding variables, like the medications that were taken and the cause of death. For example, individuals who experience a prolonged death have been shown to exhibit lower brain pH. So recently, a group of researchers in Japan aimed to investigate the brain pH using mice models, of which they were able to control the confounding factors. They hypothesized that de decreased brain pH is a pathophysiological manifestation of the di these disorders rather than a mere artifact. The researchers me measured the pH and lactate levels in five mouse models. These mice had genetic mutations associated with schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, and autism spectrum disorder. All mice were kept drug-free, the same age, and were euthanized in the same manner to ensure that those factors had no significant influence on the postmortem measurements. In the animal experiments, they observed significantly lower pH and higher lactate levels in the brains of mice models relative to controls, as well as significant negative correlation between pH and lactate levels. The present study hopes to explore some possibilities as to why there is a relationship between brain acidity and disorders like schizophrenia. One theory is that the increased acidity results from higher than normal neuronal activity in the brains of people with these disorders. And ultimately, determining whether low pH in the brain leads to cognitive or behavioral changes can provide important pathological information about psychiatric disorders.